This is the Bupoff. If you are a figure collector, some iPhones here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening everyone. Welcome back to our channel, Mad Corner here. And this is a special episode because right now we are using our DJI Osmo Pocket 3 already. So this is going to be kind of a test episode for the quality that this camera provides. And of course, since we are here in Japan, definitely we're going to try Book Off. But this time, it's not going to be the Super Bazaar. It's just a regular Book Off that I saw probably 200 meters away from this hotel. And we are staying here at Apa Hotel Hakata Ekimae. For your travel necessities, make sure to book them on Klook and take advantage of my promo code Mad Corner Klook to enjoy discounts. Again, that is Mad Corner Clue. For our viewers who asked me to buy a gimbal, finally, we did it. In the shape and form of a DJI Osmo Pocket 3. And again, thank you so much for watching my videos. And now, let's go outside because it is already 9, almost 9 p.m. And that book off closes around 10 p.m. I'm not gonna lie, I'm enjoying the wide range of angles that we can do with this camera. One thing we really like about Japan is that even though it's nighttime like this, walking around feels safe even though my camera is out i don't feel anything like i should do this i should do that nothing you can feel and act normal because it's japan this face tracking system of this dji osmo pocket is insane guys right now it is turned on and obviously it follows me <laughs> so this is what hakata looks like during nighttime Again, guys, we are just like five, 200, 300 to 500 meters away. And for people who does not know what that is, technically it is a thrift store, but it is not the super bazaar. So that means it is quite smaller compared to the ones that we always visit. So for the curious people out there, don't worry guys, I'm going to put the address of this book off on the description box down below so you can check it. Just in case you'll go here. I'm not gonna lie as well. I feel like I am not using or maximizing the potential of this camera yet. Yo, I did not expect to see this massive collection here. I'm not even sure if these things are for sale, but we're going to ask later. They are currently displayed. Here they are, right? And look at this unicorn Gundam. Wow. These are huge, man. Like super huge the lineup of gundams that they have here is impressive for this one sells for 4,000 yen not bad and they have an extensive number of display as well so we'll try to give you a view of everything here so these are the built ones okay actually i can't read all of them but the, for the price, this one is, sits at 5,000 yen. The impressive part is that I just got here. And literally, and this is the first shelf that we encountered. Sheesh! Look at those things. Aside from the built Gundams that are available here, right? Don't be fooled because they have unbuilt stuff, right? You can see there, there are boxes of unbuilt Gundams. You can pick one, buy one, depends to you. This is a Gundam Astray. I saw this one, it's really good, like super good. And then look at the other side. On the other side, of course, tons of Gundams <laughs> begging to be bought by you, of course. <laughs> If we are going to show you all of the Gundams available, it will really consume some time. So we had to stop and proceed to the next one. So there are price figures here, Q poskets. There are also some classics here. Uh, these are the Kamen Riders as they call them. And you can see there some prices for 700 yen, 1,100 yen. Those at the back are at 2,000 yen. And on this side, they are ranging at 2,300 up to 7,500 yen. Wow. Oh, that looks like the original Mask Rider, though I'm not sure. That one. Let's proceed. Ultraman here for 900 yen only. There's an H, what do you call this? SF 
SHF Figure Arts. SH Figure Arts. <laughs> there you go. Ultraman at 5,000 yen. There's also tons of Godzillas, I think, or monsters. There's even a classic Power Rangers set here. Right? For 1,300 yen only. There you go, guys. And don't be fooled because at the upper part, there's more. You can see all of them. I think these are sealed boxes. There is a good number of Ichiban Kuji prizes here, right? I'm going to give you a glimpse of them. All of them here. There's even a P.O.P. I think this is Usopp P.O.P. And then there's a Dragon uh, Master Lies. Monkey D. Luffy. Uh, BWFC, I think. Oh, no. K KOA. King of Arts. And then this one. Another Ichiban Kuji of Gear 5 Luffy. We have King here, Ichiban Kuji as well. And Price B of Ferno Azoro for the Ichiban Kuji. This one, this is a very classic IK of Ferno no Azoro. If you are a figure collector, this book off is a sleeper, guys. Don't miss this one out if you're going to Fukuoka because the prices are really good. Like, very good. Not bad, to be honest. There's even a kaiju number 8 here for 2,000 yen only. And look at this Anya. It looks so cute. And it is being sold for 4,000 yen only. There you go. I think this is a steel deal. I really like the Dragon Ball lineup that they have here. The Goku, Frieza, Raditz, Goku versus Piccolo. I forgot this one. I think this is Piccolo, Piccolo, and Cell here. I mean, not bad. We have a good lineup for Dragon Ball as well. You can see them here. I'm going to show them to you. And of course, My Hero Academia. They're here as well. Look at that Midoriya. 4,000 yen. Endeavor, 1,800 yen. This Genist, 1,300 yen only. And then Gohan here. The young Gohan for 3,400 yen. Nice, nice. Very nice lineup. You know, look at the screen for 3,000 yen only. I forgot his name, but he's the Mr. Announcer for 7,000 yen. I really wanted to buy this one for 5,000 yen only. It looks so cute. <laughs> and, and it is still sealed and brand new. But my main priority out of everything here is this Raditz that is being sold for 4,000 yen only. Though I'm not yet sure because it's quite big. Jujutsu Kaisen is such a hit here in Japan. And as you can see, Yuji Itadori. They, here they are. As you can see, Sukuna. A very small Sukuna. It looks so cute. And Gojo, the Goat Jo. There you go. You can see there are some items there. Somebody has to look at this one. This huge Mario sits at 5,400 yen only. Look at my hand. That's how massive that Mario is. It's really big. And there are four of them. Right? And there's tons of Kirby here. So if there are Kirby fans out there. To tell you honestly, your uncle here grew up with Final Fantasy. And I'm about to show you something. For Final Fantasy, you have there a Cactuar. Right? There's even a blind box here. I think it's a blind box. I'm not sure. But they have it here. I don't know how to call it. But they are busts. So for this busts, I think you can get something in random. 50% off. Wow. It is amazing to see a Moogle here for 4,600 yen only. I'm not sure if this is an... What is this? But it's a Moogle. I don't know what brand. And there's a Final Fantasy 7 character over there. I can't remember. Tifa Lockhart in a sporty dress version. We are here in the second floor, and this floor is intended for books, anime, uh, manga, and apparently there are some toys as well. And don't get fooled because there's also music stuff here, right? And there's a lot. I'm going to show you. They have a very wide selection of items here that you might want. It's just amazing to see a Beatles plaque here for 2,900 yen. And I assume that these are the rare plaques that they have. So, I'm not sure. Masahiro Kuwana someone. I'm sorry. If you guys know her, please let me know in the comment section. And this one, for 8,100 yen. Uh, this one, Shadow Factory for 9,000. 
and these are more expensive uh, i don't know this one but it's for 19,000 yen adios amigos i'm sorry this is the metallica guys and they are selling it for 40,000 yen wow it has five rows or five shelves over here at the second floor all books some anime mangas some are just random things and some are plaques for music and the classics of course we have slam dunk over here there you go another slam dunk how much is it uh i can't find the price but definitely these are for sale all right even an attack on titan blue lock one of the underrated animes i think and then my hero academia death note bleach yeah with hunter hunter i'm looking forward for the continuation of the manga by october i think yes togashi is finally moving jujutsu kaisen it's here free Ren, a very good anime and then this one kimetsu no yaiba and more classics down here i think this is the ghost in the shell yeah ghost in the shell there you go and akira yes this is akira whoa dope really really dope the art of akira just it's just different for a while i thought this is just going to be a quick video but apparently there's just too much for me to explore in here there are different kinds of books animes some are religious some are about their culture some are for kids everything and right now as i talk to you guys the face tracking of the of this dji osmo pocket 3 is just insane i really like it guys something that i found here you know this is an anime that i watched and hopefully they're going to continue it hopefully okay this is diamond no ace this is the full manga i, I assume so you can check it out later if you haven't watched this again it's diamond no ace i'm telling you for baseball fans or sports anime fans out there this is really good just for you to have an idea this is an entire season i guess i'm not sure how to call it so it says here act one act two one and then act two up to 16 i guess volume 16 i'm not sure how to call it but definitely you get the idea yo they have haikyuu here and i'm not gonna lie i like haikyuu don't get me wrong all right but when i saw blue lock oh uh, man it's a game changer so blue lock if you haven't watched that <laughs> put it in your list technically there is more to this second floor but i think i've shown you what's kind of important from my perspective all right so let's go back to the first floor i forgot to show this to you but they have some gadgets here like an ipad over there some iphones here iphone 11 iphone 11 pro max right there for 62,000 yen only wow iphone 11 pro there for 43,000 yen there's even an iphone 12 pro max 256 for 88,000 yen only i just can't help myself you know about these things that they have here i'm just surprised that they have this kind of lineup for gundams especially this one such a badass lineup right i am seriously considering that raditz and goku versus frieza master lies ichiban koji because i really like them but they will be our list priority so just in case uh, if we will not be able to buy anything and we have tons of space in our luggage those two will be on our list luckily for us we are a few minutes away from that book off so we can easily go back there in the next few days side note with all honesty this dji osmo pocket 3 when it comes to low light i, I am stunned you know it exceeded my expectations that is our book off experience here in hakata and it feels like 90 percent of the items there are related to anime figures and anime stuff and i can't help myself but to feel like it is intended for that culture which i'm totally okay with that aside from the toys i was not able to show you the cards that are available there they have a huge trading card section over there but unfortunately the music is really loud that's why i was not able to record that area and obviously i'm still learning this new camera that we have and i think that i have not yet optimized its audio capability so right now there might be a hissing sound i don't know why so i'm going to do my research later so i can provide you the best output that i can pull off from this new dji osmo pocket 3 
anyway, it's 10 p.m. already here in Japan. And guys, thank you so much for watching my videos and supporting me for the past few months. I am really grateful that our numbers are starting to move ahead of what we used to have. And because of your support, I was able to afford this new camera. If you are part of that 95% that are not yet subscribed in the channel, please hit the subscribe button guys and help your boy out here. If you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comment section and I would love to hear it from you. Next week, we're still going to see each other again and I'm going to call it a day. Mad Corner, I'm out! You feel alive, let's hit the dance floor.